everyone, Elvira here. I hope everyone's having a blessed Susie and hope a God and the angels are good to you. I wanted to tie the two videos together because we're putting these up on our website, my website, and my marketer says we need to do that. So I wanted to let you know that how that works is, is that with the workouts, Andrew makes his, my workouts and so does Dan. And then each week, every four weeks, I get a new workout. Never once do I do my own workouts. Uh, they make them for me. Um, and now that I have been with Andrew for almost a year, you know, almost two years now, he does the same thing. But I'm lucky and blessed to have both great trainers. And when I, when I was telling you guys, like, he tells me to pick that shit up, that's because I do all this uh, heavy lifting. With Andrew, I do nothing but I do deadlifts and sumos, and we do some other exercises and stuff. But the deadlifting is through him, and he's always telling me pick that shit up. And that is pretty cool because when I first started, I didn't think I'd ever get to, to, to be where I could actually lift weights. And I do. And then on top of it, what I think is unique is that with Dan and Andrew, Dan makes my workouts for what he has me do. And there are some times that the overlap on an exercise don't matter because what I screwed up with Andrew, I screw up with Dan or vice versa. <laughs> And there are some things I don't get so or I just go to my own little la la land on days But that's basically how it works and if any anybody can afford a personal trainer I think the personal trainers are worth it because you can never ever get where you're at by yourself And you can work out at any facility But the thing is is you've got to know what you're doing and are you doing it correctly? They make sure you do the exercises, right? They make my workouts, and for four weeks, I do the same weight. I do the same workout, except they increase the reps. So, like, maybe the first week with Andrew, I might be lifting I might lift uh, light. Then the following week, you're going to lift heavy. And then this, the opposite will be, um, with like with Dan, he increased the reps, too, and they increased the weight. But when you're working out, on each workout, you increase the weight as you do each time. So, like, if you do three rounds, which I normally do, the weight gets increased on all three rounds. You're not going to do the same weight. Like, like say, for example, you're lifting weights. You might start out at 95. Then they're gonna, you're going to put 10 pounds on each side. Then you're going to keep adding weight, and that's what you do. Same with Dan. I might have three rounds. I might, I'll practice with no weight on the bar, and then after that, we put weight on the bar. Sometimes I'll stay at the same and then the whole round or sometimes I won't will increase depends on what I'm doing and That I think is what's unique because when you have a trainer when you're paying for the trainers you can't beat that because they make your workouts and You learn to be friends with your trainers too And then you learn that your friends and that if and they can see what you're able to do and what you're not able to do They're not going to sit there and give you something that you can't do or they're not going to give you a weight that you can't pull you're going to pull weight until you can't pull no more. And that pretty much says, hey, you, you maxed out. And, um, you know, when I work out with Andrew and stuff, like today I did uh, sumo lifting. So with the sumo lifting, we started out at 95, which was a practice run. Then after that, we increased the weight, and I ended up finishing at 135 on a sumo lift. And before, I couldn't even get the 135 off the ground. Now I can. So... And then I had, then I take a break and then I worked out with Dan and we did legs and my legs are dead, but that's par for the course. But the thing is, is he makes my workouts. Do I ever know what they're doing? No. Um, I just do it, you know, and that's the nice thing about it is, is that with having such great trainers with Dan and Andrew, I couldn't be more blessed because God has really given me a second chance at life. And if somebody ever wants to get great trainers, Dan and Andrew are it because they come up with some of the stuff you'd never even think of. Where they come up with it, I have no idea. And But it's unique because I think that's what makes me wanting to keep going back every day is to see, okay, what are they going to do to me today? You know, what what's next on the list? And that is what is unique about it, you know. And what I like about is that with Andrew, I get to heavy lift, and that's something I've never done before, and I enjoy it. Um... And with Dan, I get to do deadlifting too. You know, I do, a lot of times I'll do the same, some of the same exercises with Dan and Andrew, but maybe just in different variety. You know, maybe I might have to do 20 with Andrew or maybe 10 with Dan or vice versa. But usually it's 15 or 25, nothing. You're not, very rarely do I get a 10 rep. That's only when I'm deadlifting. And uh, 
and stuff, but that's how it really usually works and that's where I'm at today. When I first started, no, I had little exercises to do. I remember uh, they used to, I used to have to run down the turf 10 times and I couldn't even run down the turf 10 times. I remember it took me forever. And where I'm at today is I never thought I'd be one of those people that are fit that can actually lift weights, you know, actually do what I'm doing. I watch all these people in there that lift heavier weights than me. But the point is, is that I get to do that and that's pretty cool. And with them making my workouts, it makes it nice for me because I don't have to worry about it. If I went to the gym or you go to the gym, you're not gonna know what to do. Or are we using the machines right, you know? Are we doing the right weight? They are trained in that because that's what they went to school for. So paying a personal trainer is well worth it. Um, you wanna find a good one and they are out there. I'm very blessed. I have two of the greatest trainers that I could ever have asked for. And I would never, ever want to change that. You know, if I lost one of them as my trainers tomorrow, I'd be sad. Because to where I'm at today in the deadlifting is because of Andrew. And where I'm at today with, my, with, with stuff too is with Dan. Between the two of them, I have been very blessed. And I couldn't have asked for better trainers. Yeah, they kicked my ass. That's an understatement. But the thing is, is you want that. You want that. You want them to kick your You want a trainer to kick your ass because that means that they're doing their job and you're doing your job by doing the best you can do. And that's all they ask. And that's the thing. You don't need to be obese. You don't need to be that fat. All you need to do is just get a trainer and work out. Does it work? Yeah, I'm living proof. And I enjoy it. I enjoy every day going to the gym. I don't like sometimes with our weather, but I love working out. I love working out with Andrew and Dan. I mean, yeah, I love to give them shit, but they give me shit back, you know, And but that makes it fun. You have to make it fun because when, it, when you first start, believe me, you're gonna be going home and crying. I used to go home and cry because I was, my ass was kicked so bad. But to do what I'm doing now and to get the compliments that I get, to get the, uh, Comp, to get where I'm at, um, to have such great trainers and always get told that you have such great trainers, you can't ask for anything better. Because life's short. We don't know if we're guaranteed tomorrow. We're only guaranteed today. And with, with that day that God gives us, we take that day and we run with it. We do the most that we can do. And you know, the days that I do, those four days, like I told you, today is Tuesday. I had sumo lifting, and I've sumo lift before, and believe me, I sucked before. I was proud of myself today because I did good, and I was, and Andrew couldn't believe because we, I've had some issues with sumo lifting, and it's very hard. It's different than a regular deadlift, but it can be done, and you know, I enjoy lifting. I really do, and I even told Dan that because after I'd done working out with Dan, I mean, Andrew, I had to work out Dan, and I really, really enjoy my weightlifting. I enjoy it. And whatever they give me, I do. And believe me, I get some weird stuff to do that I've never even done before, I've never even heard of. But it doesn't matter to me because I have such great trainers. That's the thing. Having a personal trainer should be part of anybody's workout. Because you know what? Look at what you pay for the gym membership sometimes. Look what you pay at the Y's. Sometimes you can take that money and put it towards a trainer. And look at it this way. If you go out to the bar one night and you spend, mm, say, when I go out on the lakes and stuff, because I live on an island in the summertime, to go to the bar and have dinner, this is just for me, and a tip is 50 bucks. Times that by four, that's 200. Right there is half your money for a trainer. Now that's just one night. Now if I go two nights, that's $100 a week. That's $400 a month, right there. You know, put towards a trainer. Does it work? Oh, yeah. Because I remember I couldn't even walk. And I had to walk to get my car this year. I walked 4.4 miles in an hour and 45 minutes. In the rain and everything. So it, it can be done. And I think what people need to realize is, is that trainers are well worth the money. They go to school for this, just like I went to school for law and to be an accountant. Um, and my licenses and stuff. When you pay for something... That's what it's all about, is getting the most for your money and getting the most bang for your buck. Do I? Oh, yeah. 
I could, I am very blessed. And every day I tell people, when people ask me about, you know, trainers and stuff, and they want me to do all these crazy ass shit. Oh, hell no. I said, you know what? Nope. Andrew and Dan got me for life. I already told them that. The day that, if they ever quit training, I would be sad. Because they are some of the best trainers I've ever seen. And I have worked with other trainers through the years. And I'll tell you what, I have never seen such great trainers as Dan and Andrew. And I'm very blessed that God looked out for me that day. And you know, for me being my third year with Dan and my second year with Andrew, I'm enjoying it. Because now I get to do the fun stuff. And I remember first starting, I used to have to do all this stupid stuff, you know. I call it stupid stuff because it was just, for me it was stupid because I left myself go. Don't let yourself go. Don't let yourself get obese. Because obesity, if you get obese, obesity can kill. It'll kill your heart, I know. And you know, when I first started, I really thought I was going to have heart attacks some days. And I have went home and thinking I'm having a hard day, but it's just because we used we did abs that day and I was dying, my, you know, and stuff. But never, ever think that you're not worth it because you're worth it. And a personal trainer is great. You could never ask for much better trainers because you know what? That's the best way to go is having a personal trainer. And with Dan and Andrew making my workouts, I love the way the, the way it works because I get... I get uh, I get my I get to weight lift with Andrew, and I get to do all kinds of neat stuff with Dan too. Um, and that's what's unique about it. They get to make the workouts. You get to enjoy it. Maybe it's not what you want, but in the end, it works. So, God bless everybody. I hope this makes sense now as to uh, how it works. And that's how it works. And if you guys want a trainer, find a great trainer. Or if you're in my area, look me up. Elvira will hook you up with Dan and Andrew because they're the greatest trainers you'll ever have. Bye. Love everyone. See you next week on The Cooking Show. See ya.